All right, so actually, we've got another 51 players back, and also I have decided to buy Fever Points for the, for the pack that I'm going to open. I'll see the 650k pack. I'm going to open it twice and save the other 4,000 Fever Points for whatever pack is released for the next promo, maybe. I just want to do this because I said, like, hitting another uh, card is out, and you're also packing it from player picks and normal packs are pretty much slim. And before anyone comments, like, oh my god, you spent Fever Points, this is the only money I spent in the game outside of buying the game, and also at the end of the day, it is my discretion to do so. Just thought I'd get it out there before someone does comment, you know, oh my god, just spent money on FIFA points, but you know, it's where it is. But we're gonna open this 51 players, but okay, first of all, let's get some um, non resonance to the club. And we're gonna get from this is Spanish striker, it's gonna be Gerard Moreno. No, it's, it's Borja Iglesias. Alright, so we've got two play picks here to open, and the irony would be if I do get Alvarez from one of these, it would be kind of annoying, but also nice at the same time. And the first one, we get John Stones, which will just maybe exchange him. And the last one for now is going to be another discard. We'll just discard Martinez and put stones into an exchange. All right, so there's a moment of truth. Did I waste doing this or will I actually be rewarded for doing this? Who knows? We're going to open two of these. Obviously, first of all, we're going to have to get a bunch of duplicates and put them into, you know, exchanges, put them into players, SBCs and stuff like that there is to do. And probably I'll do a bunch of 85 by fives and stuff like that if I get anything worthwhile doing so. Obviously, we get three guaranteed category items, one rate guaranteed to be 93 or higher. And hopefully we get Alvarez. Obviously, that's the one card I do want Alvarez. Obviously, the series is based to random, so it will be nice to get him. We're not going to waste any more time. We're going to actually do it here. And I've got it. It's actually square to do it now. And then we're going to do it here. It is obviously, you know, we're just going to we're just going to bite the bullet. You know, I mean, we're just going to we're just going to do it. There we go. It's done. Also, we guarantee category. If you see Argentinian, it's, it's Dutch centre mid. Is that wait? Well, Frank de Jong. Not if I Frank de Jong is insane. And John O'Black, okay. A 95 and a 96, past the glory. That is actually incredibly sick. Obviously, John O'Black is a goalkeeper at the end of the day. But Frank De Jong is actually sick to get. Obviously, he's going to actually miss the Euros. So, it actually, it's kind of... No, he, is, he will go upgrade the base on it. Okay. Okay, we've got quite a lot there. We didn't get Alvarez. We've got Schick, Kirchhu, Fulkrug, uh, Almiron, De Jong, and O'Black. And a bunch of high-rated walkouts, etc. As you can see... So all the cards are rated 85 higher. And in terms of the duplicates, we got Pop, Enla, Modric, Shandra Panos, and Stones. So the first one, obviously no Alvarez, is kind of a shame. But we get De Jong and our Black. So that is sick. Obviously, our Black will most likely go into the team. De Jong will make the bench. Five star, five star. What place our pluses does he have? Incisive, anticipate, and technical. Yeah, he's got to go on the bench, man. Obviously, also with Neverlands. I mean, Neverlands, they're a hit and miss nation, you know. I mean, they, they've got a good team, but. They never really get that far, somehow. So I'm going to sort out all the duplicates and then open the second one. Alright, so with all the duplicates I put into the... Well, we got from the first one. I'd like to put them into exchange packs because there's not a lot of fodder in this game right now. And I thought, you know what, I'm, it's more worthwhile me getting fodder than trying to complete maybe Drogba. Who I might use and might not use, who knows, you know what I mean? If I did complete him, I would use them. That's going to be fish lock though. But I don't think I will be able to complete him anyway. Unless I've got like insane amount of fodder, you know I mean, to complete all the squads needed. There's like, I think it's 290s and 89, 80 and 87, or something like that, somewhere around that. Obviously, with these, we get fodder, we get non regals to put into play picks, etc. Which I love to see. I see them we get more chances of getting cars, etc., and all that stuff. So it's actually works out like better in a way. You have 219 play packs there to open, and obviously, we open the, well, the final pack I'm opening for the video, the other Path to Glory guarantee. And hopefully we get, um, that's going to be Busquets. Hopefully we get um, Alvarez in that one. I should specify in Julian Alvarez before, you know, I get Edson Alvarez. Let's do that. As so if in the first one, we got Dion, or Black, and a bunch of others. So it wasn't a worse, it was not a bad pack. Dion will go on the bench, probably in, instead of Barella. That's a sure about that though. But Italian centre-back, unless it's Bastoni, it's not anything that good. It's a Cherby, I know it would be. I can just get some coins for, uh, for Matt's video Arnold, Arnold there. The final to exchange packs here, we get a 27 player pack, or two 27 player packs. Here are some walkouts on these. Our American right back, not going to be anything good there. It's probably going to be Sergio Des, which is an awful pack to get. No it's a horror. And then those two can go down there. And then the final 27 players back here we're going to open when it decides to load. 
All right, so a couple of minutes I'm finally able to open this pack again because obviously the game wasn't loading what I was trying to do, which is this guy just two players, but you know it is what it is. We got a Spanish centre mid, but I certainly know Danny Perejo. Could be double walkout, most likely won't be though. Oh, okay, we got Van Dijk and Danny Perejo, and I'll exchange Danny Perejo and maybe, you know, put these into a player pick. Alright, so before we get into another exchange pack, we're going to open this player pick here, just to sort of the duplicate side, and we get 82 right at bottom, or not great, obviously, but we're putting 82 in. Let's cut that out. Alright, so we've got another player's pack here to open, obviously put, uh, put Danny Pro into this exchange to get, or just get him sorted and get something from this, hopefully. Get a Spanish right back. I don't think it can be anything great, if I'm not mistaken. It's Danny Carver Howe. It's a walk up winner, but nothing too great in the game these days. Obviously, we're going to finally open the final category pack and hopefully get Julian Alvarez. I mean, if I don't get Alvarez, I will be a little bit depressed. You know what I mean? Considering I did this just to get Julian Alvarez. But if I don't, then it is where it is. You know what I mean? We don't need to get him for the series. But it would be nice to get him, you know what I mean? So we're going to open this here. I keep forgetting it's not X to open a pack these days, it's a square. Not sure why they changed it, but you know it is where it is. But another set of fuel points gone, and we get to, we're hoping to see Argentinian. We see Danish, goalkeeper. It's an icon. Okay, we've got Schmeichel, 96 rated. Okay, we'll take that. So we get both goalkeepers in the promo. We've got John Black and uh, Peter Schmeichel. And we get John Black again, great. So we get two John Blacks. Love to see it. Hopefully see it here Alvarez behind him. Got it, surely, man. Come on. Oh, we get Shavadio. I mean, I'm happy with Shavadio, but no Alvarez. We get Keen. Why is he in this? I think you could get um, normal hero some of these. Ah, it's kind of depressing. I mean, we get, we get Suka and Schmeichel. As we get John Black duplicate, we get 23 duplicate items. Oh, we've got full Chris Skinner and him again. Plus all of these. It's going to be a pain, pain to sort out. Maybe I could... Honestly, I might be able to do Drogba now. As you putting these into some squads, we'll boost the rating. But we didn't get Alvarez. So, obviously, missing mission kind of failed. Oh, no. No, mission is failed. We get Shavardi Aldo. Which, obviously, is a card that I did want to get. He can play left back in my team. Over Beasley, most likely, was his player styles. Ping to pass, block, and jockey. Obviously, we've got Sucre as well. Who isn't a bad card to get. But I, I am a bit annoyed that we didn't get, you know, Alvarez, because that was the one card that I did want to get, you know. But, you know, it is where it is. At the end of the day, it is where it is. We've just got to, you know, take your losses and move on with them. I mean, I could open another pack if there aren't any more guarantees, but I don't think there are, if I'm not mistaken. We'll sort these orders out pretty soon. I'll just do that probably off camera. I'm not going to look at the packs until I sort this out. No, I'm not. So I'm going to sort this out, but obviously mission is failed. We did not get to the Navarez, but, you know, I was hoping, you know, I'd at least, you know, spending the money, I'd get rewarded by getting Alvarez. Because it's a 94 rated card, you know what I mean? And considering I got a 96 duplicate and two 93s, it could have just given me Alvarez, you know what I mean? But you know, it is where it is, man.